Okay, guys, got some good news. Uh, found the problem, the issue with the with the monitor, and I was able to. Well, my wife was able to figure it out and fix it. Okay, and uh, let's see if it's uh, as accurate as it should be. So um, let me go over exactly what you need to do, and it's and it's it's pretty quirky. If you didn't know, you would never know because um, you're just not gonna know. know. If if you had an XT two, you won't know. If you have if you just bought this XT two D two, and you never had an XT two D, there's no way you're gonna know. So it takes a lot of searching and searching and digging through the menu. So let me show you what, what it is, guys. So what you do is you go to the menu, okay? And you go to general, scroll down all the way to service. Hit service and go all the way down to calibrate. You hit that calibrate, sensor calibration. And what you do is you put the lens on it, go through the procedure. It takes about 17 to 20 minutes to calibrate and you can hear it. And then don't turn it off, whatever you do. And then it should be calibrated on the new lens. The old lens, um, I don't know. So that seems to be the culprit. And um, like I said, uh, if nobody told you this, you wouldn't know. It's under the service section. Okay, guys. So uh, for those who own the X2D2, well, there you go. Luckily, my wife was able to figure it out. Okay, guys. Some good news here, but the rest of the other issues regarding HDR, interval timing, that's still an issue. All right, guys. Bye.